In this video, we'll learn about the device designer. As the name says, W will help us to design our layout in the dashboard so that it is properly visible in the different mobile phones, in your tablets or your desktop, different devices. Let us see how W will help us. For that, what I've done is, I first created a workbook named as device designer. In that, I have created three different sheets. One is the subcategory sales, sales trend, and the third one's sales by order priority. Now what I'll do is I'll combine all of them at one place in a dashboard and I will show you how it looks like on the different devices. Let's see that. So first of all, I've created a dashboard that's an empty dashboard here. And these are the three sheets which I've created and they are visible here. So first of all, I'll pick up some of the sheets, first one, and then I'll pick up the second one and I'll make sure it comes down. Yeah, so it is done here. Now if you observe, it is not completely visible, the second chart itself. I have to scroll down to see the entire chart itself, the entire dashboard. So what I can do is, if I want to fit it properly at one place, I can select this option as desktop size, click on this fixed size, click on this automatic and I can see both the charts which are given at one place itself. Now, I was talking about the device designer, how it looks like on different devices. So first of all, I'll select this option as device preview and if you see, there's a small toolbar which comes on the top which helps me to select the device type the model which is given and also the scape which is the landscape or the portrait. So what I'll do is I'll pick up this de uh, device type here. If I click on this drop down, I can select any device, desktop, the tablet or the phone. So first of all, I'll pick up this phone here. The moment I select the phone, if you see the size of the screen has been compacted to the portrait form. Because if you observe the mobile phones are in the portrait, whereas the tablets are in the landscape form. So if I click on this place and if I select as tablet, if you see it comes in the landscape mode. If I select the phone, it comes in the uh, you can see as the portrait mode itself. Now, if I select a phone, what are the different models which are available? According to them, you can design your preview itself. So if I click on this drop down, these are the different mobile phones models which are given. If you see that's iPhone 5, it looks like that in iPhone 5. If you click on this drop down in iPhone 6, it would look like this because the screen size also changes there. So if I like this phone, if I like this device type, if I like the model, I can just select this option as add phone layout this layout will be added below this place. So if I click on this add phone layout and if you observe below this default, I'm getting this phone itself. Now this whatever changes I'll be making, it will be visible in this phone part itself. Do you want the default thing which should be available or do you want to customize? So I'll select this option as custom and I don't want uh, the dashboard should look like this in my mobile phone. So what I'll do is I'll try to modify this. First of all, I'll close this legend. I'll select this and I'll close this legend. And now if you see it is properly visible for me. So this is how I want to look in my mobile phone itself, the iPhone 5 part. But if I want, if I can just go to this default part, in the default it would look like this. In your phone device it would look like this. Okay, so it is better now. Let's see one more. If I want to see how it looks like in the tableau part, so I'll click on this drop down and I can select the option as tablet. And inside tablet, as I said, it comes into the landscape mode. If you see, that's a landscape mode. And I'll select what type of tablet I want. If I want something as Google Nexus 7. So in Google Nexus 7, it will look like that. And if you want, you can remove this legends part. Select this, close this. Or oh, first thing, what I'll do is, I'll make sure this is selected. So if you see, there's only default and phone which is added. I'll add this layout. That's a add tablet layout on the left hand side. When I add this layout, if you observe here, that's a tablet. Now I can customize this tablet, not the default one, but I can make it into a custom part. Now I can do the changes. So make sure you don't do the mistake like what I'm doing here. So I'll just click on this close part, select this, click on this close part. Now it will look like that. Let's see one in one go how it looks. So in the tablet, it would look like that. In the phone, mobile phone, it would look like that. Okay. And by default, this is the view which you'll be getting it, right? So this is how a tableau will help us to look how it looks on the different devices. I hope you have understood about the device designer. That's all for this video.